Hey guys, it's Sarah. I am doing a World Teach House video to show everybody my family back home where I live and for also anybody who is interested in thinking about the program, they can see what the Pongo Pongo house looks like. I am with World Teach American Samoa 2016 and this is the Pongo house. So I'm gonna go in. All the World Teach volunteers live on the second floor and we have a neighbor who is very sweet who lives downstairs with her husband. So when you go upstairs, you are right in the kitchen. This house has been used by volunteers for a few years, so they left us a lot of kitchen gear, which is very nice, but it's very functional. And then, <coughs> you go outside, and we have a clothesline to dry our clothes in a traditional Samoan oven called an umu, but we have not used that yet. And then if you look around, you will see all of our neighbors. It's very pretty out here. And then when you go in, you go straight back into the living room. We have a very nice house. So there's TV. Stay away, cat. You go outside, it's my favorite part of the house. Um, we have this huge balcony. Um, all of our clothes are drying right now because we went swimming in a waterfall. Uh, some locals showed us yesterday, which is really awesome. And there's also cats. Very sweet. It's very hard for me not to let them inside. I love pets. <laughs> um, if you look up, that forest all up around us is the National Park of American Samoa. We were at the bottom, and you go up, there's a trailhead. It's pretty amazing. <clears throat> my roommate Haley. Hi. You go in right here we have an empty room because we had a roommate had to get switched to a different school so she got put in a different house. But here's her room. It's a pretty decent size. And then you go over here we have the master bedroom. We let one of our roommates have it. Um, it's a very nice room. Huge king size bed, a nice desk. Um, she has her own closet space and her own bathroom, which is really nice. And then back over this way, we have the bathroom me and Haley share. It's very functional. It's a decent bathroom. It's got a shower. Um, Haley has a really pretty room with a king size bed and a futon. Um, it's very pretty. Her closet. And then you go out to my room, which I have the smallest room, but I really like it because it has really pretty views. Um, these fans are a necessity because it is so hot. We do not have air conditioner that we turn on because it would run our bill up. So here's my full size bed with one sheet. Trust me, you do not need more than one sheet here. And my ukulele, and my desk, and my closet area, which I put this up, but my clothes are back here. And then if you look outside my windows, I have a beautiful view. And all my neighbors.
But this is my house in World Teach, uh, Pongo Pongo. Um, if anybody has any questions about it or liked me to show them anything else, let me know. I think I'm going to do a walk to school through my village and put it online soon. But thanks for watching. And if anybody's thinking about World Teach, just give me an email or comment and I'll answer any questions you guys have. Thanks, Tofa.